Final round action, the Corrales Punta Cana Championship in the Dominican Republic. Alex Smalley on the front side of the golf course after a 73 on Saturday. He was making putts early. That would move him to 13 under. Share of the lead on the line for Jonathan Vegas as he was trying to pour one in at the sixth. And Vegas with a very solid play early on. Three birdies through six holes after a 65 on Saturday as he joins the lead. Ben Martin opening up with a double bogey at the first. Certainly a surprise to see that, but he was battling back with a couple of key shots on the front side. Pulls that one back close to the cup, setting himself up for a birdie. And then Martin looking for another. As he would keep it rolling. Cameron Percy at the seven. This bird a share of the lead as he drops in the eagle. And he jumps to 15 under par in search of his first win. Back to Smalley on the back nine. This at 11. And he makes that putt getting to 15 under. Limited number of starts for a few of these players. But for Martin, he certainly has had experience on tour. But his last win was all the way back in 2014. Playing on the past champion category. Chases this one up the left side as he would set himself up for birdie. He would get to 16 under par. Now, Asmus Hoygaard playing on the World Tour much of the year, but coming over to the States to compete on the PGA Tour, and this time on the island here in Punta Cana. He makes the birdie from there. Brian Stewart looking for birdie at 16. That would take him to 14 under par. Stewart trying to see if he can't push his way towards the top. Back to Alex Smalley, tee shot at 17. Running out of golf holes, but on the move. This one to that back pin. Wind helping right along the Caribbean blue waters. And Smalley would make the putt. He would post at 16 under. But here comes Chad Ramey making a move on the back nine. 29-year-old rookie on the PGA Tour sets himself up for birdie. Would brush that one in. Ben Martin also at 14 in the final group right alongside Ramey. And he would pick up his birdie as well. On to the 15th. Now for three birdies in a row. Ramey on the move as he takes it to 16 under par. He's not done though. Looking for the solo lead. Four birdies in a row. Yes, that one's in. He goes to 17 under, and it would come down to the final hole after a great approach. This is Ben Martin to Ty Ramey. Right at five feet, and he just misses the cup. Hard to believe after the great approach that he didn't have the read, but he misses out. So now a par to clean things up. And Chad Ramey, for the first time in his young PGA Tour career, just 16 starts, and as a rookie, he is now the ninth first-time winner this season. Um, I had a pretty good idea, but honestly, I didn't. I just trying to keep my head down and just uh, just keep grinding it out because you, know, you never know till the end. Yeah, getting your first win on your PGA Tour, especially in your rookie year. When you look back at this day, how will this influence the rest of your career? Um, I mean, I, I just think it'll give me a lot of confidence. You know, I, I've always had the self-belief that I could get it done, and you know, I proved it today. Thanks for watching the PJ Tour on YouTube. To watch more, click here, and to subscribe, click here.